Hi, my name is Demarius and I am the Customer Success Manager at Learner. In this video, I will go through all of the features of Learner. My objective is to help you have a smooth transition as you use Learner to help your students learn. Here are some quick facts to highlight the features in Learner. Learner integrates with your LMS such as Canvas, Blackboard, Moodle, or D2L. And grades in Learner automatically sync to your LMS gradebook. We customize each course to your needs. Each course can be shared with all faculty in the department to avoid duplication of effort. Learner is very flexible. All of the courses include pre-built adaptive quizzes and activities that we built from the ground up. You can also build questions and activities when needed. You can also reuse and share your assignments. This can make it easy for department onboarding. Okay, so the first thing you will see when you sign in is my courses. This will have your course list where you can find all of your available courses as you see right here. And each course is able to have multiple sections, making it easy to assign homework across different sections. Now let's go to one of the courses so that you can see the learner dashboard. And on the learner dashboard, you see learn, practice quizzes, assignments, grade book, reports, favorites, flashcards, activities, 3D bodies, my bank, and videos. I will go through every one of these so that you can see how the features actually work. So we will start with Learn. Inside of Learn, you will find the practice quizzes, flashcards, activities, and videos, and even Favorites are associated with Learn as well, and I will show you how all these things are connected. So let's click on Learn. When you first come into Learner, you'll notice that you have the navigational bar at the top where you're able to navigate throughout the platform. And on the left side, you see the table of contents. And in the table of contents, you have your chapters and your chapter sections. We can customize the table of contents to align with your syllabus and pedagogy. And in the middle, we have the main content window that has the interactive textbook. We have also embedded additional high quality images and interactive content that aligns with the OpenStax text to enhance the student experience. You can take notes, you can highlight, and you can bookmark. And that brings us over to the right that has the adaptive sidebar. And as well with the adaptive sidebar, you have the smart content. So as you move throughout the textbook, then the smart content changes on the side. And the smart content includes your glossary, your flashcards, your activities, your quizzes, and it even contains videos. And in the adaptive sidebar, you have the annotations, which contains all of your bookmarks and your highlights and your notes. And you can find them just by clicking on them and it goes straight to them in the section. Now let's talk about favorites. If you go to your navigation bar, and you go down to favorites, you can see that favorites has organized all of your bookmarks and highlights and notes by chapter and section. So it's like an organized study guide. Learner has multiple choice questions, fill in the blank questions and hybrid questions. With multiple choice questions, Learner gives right and wrong answer feedback 
to help students gain more understanding. With the fill in the blank questions, Learner allows you to get the answer 95% correct. So even if you misspell, you can still get points for the question and it will give you the full correct answer. With hybrid questions, Learner will adapt to the student. So if the student is doing a fill in the blank and the student cannot get the fill in the blank correct, then it becomes a multiple choice question. We have 35 types of activities, including 3D activities for anatomy and physiology. These activities allow you to be more engaged and interactive and improves overall efficacy of students. We have cadaver activities that include about 133 2D activities with the view of both human cadavers and 3D human images. Let's go to assignments. In assignments, you have two types of assignments that you are able to create. And that's the homework, which is the formative assignment, and then the test assignments, which are summative. It's very easy to create an assignment. Let me show you how. Let's do a homework assignment. You write your title first. Then you choose what your students will study. You can choose the videos that they watch. You can choose the flashcards, the activities. Also, the practice quizzes and the homework quizzes. Then you go down and you check if it's graded. Then you choose how it will be grouped by section or chapter. The attempts, you give points. You also can customize. And the My Bank is your own questions that you created yourself. Then you go down and choose your section. You choose the date to start, and then you choose your due date, and you choose the amount of days for submission, and you save it. And also in assignments, you are able to edit your assignments. You're able to see the details of the assignments that you create. You're able to duplicate assignments and you're able to create templates. And I want to talk a little about the templates. Templates make it easy for you to reuse and share tests and quizzes so that you won't have to create them again and that others will be able to use the same tests and quizzes that you have already created and you can share them with other professors in your department or even throughout the full department. We have the single assignment gradebook where you can see the grades of all the students for a single assignment. And if you go to the review of that student, you can see detailed analytics for that student. We also have the cumulative gradebook where you can see the overall grades for each student. This gradebook automatically syncs to your LMS. We also have 3D bodies for the human anatomy part of anatomy and physiology and biology. And the students are able to use these to enhance their study experience. Okay, we have went through all the features. Thank you so much for considering Learner.